Welcome to another Tuesday with Tiffany, your KVHD Registered Dietitian Nutritionist. I wanted to provide some heart healthy nutrition advice since February is American Heart Month. Happy Heart Health Month! Use up at least as many calories as you take in. Start by knowing how many calories you should be eating and drinking to maintain your weight. Nutrition and calorie information on food labels is typically based on a 2,000 calorie per day diet. You may need fewer or more calories depending on several factors, including age, gender, and level of physical activity. Maintain and achieve a healthy body weight and get moving. A healthy diet along with exercise improves blood pressure, cholesterol, and heart health. Aim for at least 150 minutes of moderate physical activity or 75 minutes of vigorous physical activity each week. Control your portion sizes. Overloading your plate and eating until you feel stuffed can lead to eating more calories than you should. Portions served in restaurants are often more than anyone needs. Use a smaller plate or bowl to help control your portions when you're at home. Eat an overall healthy dietary pattern. Eat a wide variety of fruits and vegetables and try to aim for a combined seven to nine servings of fruits and vegetables each day. Vegetables and fruits like other plants or plant-based foods contain substances that may help prevent cardiovascular diseases. Keep vegetables washed and cut in your refrigerator for quick snacks. Keep fruit in a bowl in your kitchen so that you will remember to eat it. Choose recipes that have vegetables or fruits as the main ingredient, such as a vegetable stir fry or fresh fruit mixed into salads. Eat whole grains and products made up mostly of whole grains. Whole grains are good sources of fiber and other nutrients that play a role in regulating blood pressure and heart health. Eat healthy sources of protein, mostly plants, such as legumes and nuts, fish and seafood, low-fat or non-fat dairy, and lean, unprocessed meat and poultry. Substituting plant protein for animal protein, for example, a soy or bean burger, in place of a hamburger. This will reduce your fat and cholesterol intake, and it will increase your fiber. Limit your intake of processed foods and added sugars in your drinks and beverages. Limit how many saturated fats and trans fats you eat is an important step to lower your risk of coronary artery disease. Eating too much salt can lead to high blood pressure, a risk factor for heart disease. The American Heart Association recommends that a healthy adults have more than 2,300 milligrams of sodium a day. That's about a teaspoon of salt. Remember moderation and allow yourself an indulgence every now and then. A candy bar or a handful of potato chips will not derail your heart healthy diet. Finding a balance is what is important and will allow for long term success following a heart healthy diet. Until next time, please take this message to heart and please take care of yourself and your heart health.